Yeah! Konichi mother fluffin' wa. You got it. I'm tricky. And I'm General Muffin. And there's more boobs. Back to Don't Die Dayless, dummy. Yep. And uh, if you remember the last episode... We died. We got our shit kicked in. We so figured out how to save. Yeah, we did figure out how to save. So yeah, I actually have save files this we time. We do have save. And what I did was, this top one, uh, Marcus, just so you know, because I know I haven't showed you this yet. This top one, I kept all our stats the same up to the point where we're outside the bathroom. This uh -huh. is where I saved them all, right outside the bathroom before uh -huh. I made that choice. Um, this one, I believe, is the one where I did an even mix between, like, a little bit more strength, but also kept some intelligence. And I believe this one is where I just made us buff as fuck. So, let's, I, let's, let's go, go back the, to the original. Yeah, to the bathroom. All right. I've seen you guys play this before. You have? Yeah. Phew! Felt like that class was never going to end. Time the, to go uh, meet up with Ellie so we can head off to the fair. All right. You hear voices coming from the women's bathroom. Up to the old tricks again, huh, you floozy? I knew it. it. It's not like that. Hi. What? 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 Yeah, it's just bitch. It's, it's, it's bitch. There's it's, no way. There's no two ways around. Yeah. Wait a minute. I recognize that voice. It's Leah. God, what do you want to do? Um, we saved Leah last time. Do you want to try and save her again and maybe do something different? Like maybe run from the guy instead? Or do you want to go pick up Ellie before she gets mad? I kind of want to see what happens with Ellie. Not, not, okay. not in the sense of us no, going no, to get her, but like no, let's fine. save Leah and then see what our interaction is going to be like with Ellie afterwards. Okay. That's what so I'm we're curious gonna, about. So we're going to try and save Leah. But gonna, I, think, I think no matter what, no, see, th th I think no matter what, we're still going to have to face that guy, so we're going to have to run this time. Yeah. Because yeah. we couldn't fight him. Yeah. All right. You barge into the bathroom. Like a true man. Indeed. What the heck are you doing in here? I don't know you, but this... <laughs> <laughs> this. Go ahead, Reed. Just go ahead. You're good. It's okay. But just quit okay. harassing her. Stop being an immature... <laughs> 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 yeah. Dyslexics have all the nuff. Oh man. <sighs> let's try let's try this again. You got it. I believe in you. <sighs> Deep breaths. Alright. <clears throat> all right. <laughs> I don't know who you <laughs> I don't know you, but just quit harassing her. Stop being an immature vindictive bitch and leave her alone. It's obvious your man you'll never be as beautiful or kind hearted as Leah. I'm sure everyone else has noticed that as well. You know, that probably would have been a lot more intimidating if you could have said it in one goddamn shot. Sorry. Huh? Kim's a bitch. <laughs> Who do you think you are, punk? I'm calling security. Let's go, Leah. You take Leah out of there, and the both of you run off campus to a nearby park. Bound chicka wow wow. I'm I'm sorry I got you involved like this, my dick. <laughs> <laughs> I want to defend her up myself back there, but all, all those bad memories just came back and I... She has no business treating you like that. I didn't even realize it by turn. It's okay. Next time, I know I'll be able to do it, my dick. What are you dumb? Of course you will. I believe in you. All right. My dick, thank you. I feel so much more at ease now since I'm with you. I'm never apart from mine. <laughs> the two of you talk until sunset and decide to head back before it gets dark. Suddenly, some dude appears in front of you. It's Alan, Kim's latest boy toy. This guy again. Well, well, here's the punk. Who are you? Hey, big man. I heard what you did to my girl in the bathroom. Whoa, I'm going girl. to make you regret that. <laughs> I didn't do anything. You calling my girl a liar, tough guy? Let's see how tough you are after I'm done with you. Looks like this dude won't go without a fight. Okay, we gotta run this time, right? Yes. Run for it. We're cowards. Deuces! You decide to make a run for it. Fighting this loser isn't worth it. You take Leah's hand and start... Oh, we lost again. And start running. But Alan easily catches up to you. <laughs> what were you thinking? This isn't like your Chinese cartoons where you can just take your girl's hand and expect to effectively run somewhere. Point well made. <laughs> Maybe if you had more intelligence. What? You would have done the correct thing when trying to run away. Instead, Alan pulverizes you and leaves you on the concrete blacked out. You don't know what happened to Leah, but you find out she transfers schools a few days later. Well, shit. Since you ditched Ellie earlier to save Leah, she never speaks to you again. Depressed, you give up on girls forever and spend the rest of your days a broken man. You turn 30 without knowing true love. You're a wizard, my dick. Yay! Alright, so what I'm thinking is maybe we actually have to avoid the bathroom and just go beat 
Ellie. Because uh, we don't have enough strength or yeah. intelligence, apparently. So let's just so. go. Let's go back to the first file and let's just just go meet Ellie. Okay. Because okay. I mean, there's no way that she would know that we didn't show up. Okay. I'm not. I don't want to. Yeah, that's fine. Want to do this me. all again? So. Yeah. All right, so um, I'm going to do something different. It's none of my business. Better go pick up Ellie before she gets mad. Geez, you're late. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, she's excited. Wow. <laughs> How nostalgic. Question mark? When I was little, I used to play at a place like this near my house. <laughs> I always loved the swings. Got her. Freaking. <laughs> so it's nice. I wish I could go back. Life was so carefree back then out in the West. But the older you get, the more worries start piling up. Ain't that the truth. So, you didn't have much of a uh, adolescence either. Is he saying she always had boobs like that? I think that's where it's going. Question mark? I just wish I could have done all the things other kids got to do. I mean, complaining about this seems silly and all, but I don't want to look back when I'm older and feel all those regrets. These regrets. I'm illiterate. I'm from the South. Sorry. Hey, I resent that <laughs> remark. I know. I resent I remember that, that remark. I remember that. No, I forgot. Sorry. Like I said, that's what we're trying to change now. But, were your parents really that strict? They have high expectations of me. I'm an only child after all. Don't I have the responsibility to make them proud? Heh. <laughs> I remember when I was nine, my father yeah, insisted that, that I take... Oh my good lord. That I take tennis lessons. Grandma was a regional champion, so he probably wanted me to follow in her footsteps, but I absolutely hated playing tennis. After the first couple of sessions, I, could, <laughs> I couldn't take any more. I wanted to quit. I cried and cried. Boo-hoo. Even going so far as to tell my father I hated him when he tried to stand his ground. Wow, she told her own dad. Oh, my God. Well, in the end, I got my way, but I'll never forget that disappointed look in his eyes. Grandma had recently passed away, after all. You heartless bitch. I promised myself I would always try my best to make him proud from then on. Um, what do you think? Um, yeah. Which one? Second one. That doesn't mean you Okay, yeah. You're right. I might still be trying to make it up to him after all this time by studying to become a doctor. Anyway, I'm sorry you had to hear my pitiful sob story. Yeah, me too. Let's get going. Yeah, I'm sorry I had to read all that. The two of you get to the fair and spend the first couple of hours going on rides and playing games. Ellie seems to be having lots of fun. Dust. Yeah, that was fun. Let's take a break, my dick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, like, good God. Before I get, so hard. Before you get friction burns. Uh, um, maybe we can talk for a bit. Ooh. Who are we getting it in? Sure. Sure. I don't want to. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Wow, this is a, you guys are great this is a this. great conversation. Oh, oh no. no. The dreaded awkward silence. I'm still not used to this. What do you want to do? Pick up an intelligent Try conversation. To be funny. Ooh, yeah, because apparently our intelligence is low. We'll do that. We're stupid. Popping some jokes and some of that old humor totally backfired. You don't have enough charisma to pull it off. Ellie looks a bit annoyed. So apparently we have not put enough effort into a single skill. Is there anything you want to know about me? Um. Did we ask? Did we? Yeah. We know what her major is. Do you have any siblings? She, we already know. We already know she's an only child. Oh yeah. So I guess yeah. That's the only option. Right. Plans for the week. Well, it's my birthday on Sunday. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can do something then too. All right. We saved it. Of course. Great. The two of you finish up chatting and spend the rest of the day having a good time at the fair. After the day at the fair, you spend the rest of the week thinking about Ellie's birthday. Before you know it, Sunday is here. What should you and Ellie do for her birthday? Ooh. Like Go snow. to the beach. Yeah, because let's not bring back that trauma. <laughs> the two of you spent a nice day at the beach. Oh, my dick. You're, You're so, so sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for... <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just... It's... The way this is working. Yeah, taking her to paradise. Thanks so much for taking me here. Um, Let's go back to my place, okay? Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Okay? I'm close. Okay. My dick. I wanted to tell you I've really had fun this past week. <laughs> Since my parents have been gone. <laughs> it's all thanks to you. I really want to spend more time with you. I, I'm starting to fall for you. Holy shit, we won Ellie's heart. Oh my god. Woo! What a set. Did we just win? I think we won. Bit by bit, the both of you start becoming more outgoing after having all sorts of fun experiences together. Sex. In bed. 
As the two of you tread forward in life hand in hand, the future is bright. Ellie excels in her studies and fulfills her dream of becoming a doctor. As for you, the only thing that matters is that you don't become a level 30 wizard. Hooray! Okay, we got one. Do you want to try and get uh, Leah? Because, I mean, this is this is kind of short so far. Do you want to try and get Leah too? I think we can get them both. Yeah, let's let's go after Leah. Okay, let's go after Leah. Um, this is the one where I was buff as shit. So, oh. do you think we need a little bit of intelligence for? Yeah, um, let's because let, I'm 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 curious as to um, what they meant by if you had a little bit more intelligence, you would have made the right choice. But we don't have a lot of intelligence in this one. We have actually less intelligence than the other one. In the second one? Yeah, because the second one this I put here? more. Yeah, because I put more effort into getting buff so that way we could beat his that, ass. That's the one that's buff. That's right? the one that's nothing but buff. This is the one that's a little bit intelligent, but still more buff than what we um, had. Um. Let's try, let's try being buffer than shit then. Alright, buffer than shit it is. Phew! Felt like that class was never going to end. Time to go meet up with Ellie so we can head off to the fair! Oh boy! Yeah, boy, she's coming from the women's bathroom. Up to the old tricks again, huh? You floozy, I knew it! It's not like that, I... What, bitch? <laughs> Wait a minute, I recognize that voice. It's Leah, that was your line, I apologize. It's okay, that's not the right. Alright, it's not my best, but I said Leah, gotcha. Bars in the bathroom. Okay. She's involved in this, my dick. She has no business treating you like that. Um. Yeah, same thing. Why not? Yep, yep. My okay. dick. Thank you. Of course. I'll always okay, stand up for you. Okay. Yeah, okay. So no matter what we do, it's gonna be a problem. So fuck off, dickhead. Who's that tough guy? Blah blah blah. Looks like you do Let's fight him. Come at me, bro. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> You try to dodge his punch, but are unable to. It doesn't matter, though, since you take it like a champ and counter with your own swing. Nice. He goes down! This dude has a glass jaw! Who would have thought? You make a run for it to catch up to Leah down the street. She's visibly shaken by the Odora. So you... The Odora. The Odora. The Odora. So you take the hors d'oeuvres. So you take her home. Fuck yeah. Thank you for taking me home, my dick. But would you like to come in? Sure. Sure. No one has ever stood up for me like that before. You're the nicest guy I've ever met, my dick. I love the time we spent together. And oh, even yeah. though I haven't known you very long, I feel I can trust and depend on you. Lately, when I'm around you, I feel my heart beating like crazy. Yeah. My dick, will you be by my side from now on? <laughs> Where was it before? Wait, why would you want it by your side? On her you? back. Because so, that way she can hold it like a gun. Like, ah. like, she probably has a holster for it and everything. It's a six-shooter, by it the way. It just pulls it out. <laughs> Pew, By the way, it's a forever? six Forever? Uh, or no thanks. No. Fuck no, forever. Alright, forever. <laughs> nice. Congratulations, you've won Leah's heart. With your help, Leah becomes a stronger, more confident person and learns to stand up for herself against Kim. Good shit. Fucking great. I didn't realize her hair was actually that long. You settle the score with Alan, who eventually wisens up to Kim's true nature. You and Leah live happily ever after, and most importantly, you don't become a level 30 wizard. It seems to be a prominent thing here. That was easy. Um... What do you think happens if we say no to him? Do you think we become a level 30 wizard? Probably. Do you want to try anyway? <laughs> we try anyway? I mean, if you if you really want to. I want to see what happens if we reject their love. So we're going to do that on the next episode real quick before we call it a night. We'll be back. Bye, guys. Bye.